Hey guys, a couple weeks ago I posted a video where I showed a little trick that I uh, have been using, which is this, the mousetrap tape dispenser. This is a mousetrap three inch tape dispenser, search it on Amazon. Uh, way better than the standard uh, tape dispenser like this, where you got the core and everything. This is a mess, it's, it's loud. This thing's practically silent. It puts a real even stripe of tape on the box for you. Um, just great it's a couple bucks more worth every penny of it so I want to show you guys a couple other little tips and tricks that I've been using that I think might help people so first one are these okay search on Amazon alcohol dispenser okay these are used in the nail industry uh, like uh, salons that do your nails and what they do is you pump down on it so I have a little paper towel here okay and it's dry I just press down on it one-handed and just squirts a little bit of alcohol up. You can't even really see it, but that's got a little bit of alcohol on it, just enough to take some stuff off. It's all one-handed, so you can be holding your product with one hand, tape dispensing, or getting the alcohol with the other. Very, very easy, very convenient. Um, I have one that works for acetone. These work for alcohol, acetone. I have one for Gugon, lighter fluid. They, uh, they're pretty sturdy um, as far as holding chemicals that you would think might dissolve them, they're fine. Um, they're like eight bucks for three of them. So here's another little trick, plastic razor blades, okay? I use these more than I use Scotty peelers now. So the beautiful thing about these is they're eight dollars for a hundred of them or nine dollars for a hundred of them. So when the edge gets funky, you throw it out, okay? I go through dozens of these sometimes a day. If I'm really taking a lot of stickers off, the edge is nice. It's actually a razor sharp plastic edge. Uh, there's different types of them. There's an orange variety that's double sided, whatever you like. And I actually, it comes with, uh, some of them come with like a little razor blade holder. This one I actually have a regular razor blade on. I was cleaning something with it. So um, it'll make it a little bit more convenient to hold, but I like to hold them by hand just like this and it comes right off. So real nice and easy. Um, of course, you guys know about Scotty peelers. So, I mean, this is, in my opinion, it's a, as effective as a Scotty peeler, and it's cheap enough to give it a try. Um, another thing that I use, this is big for me, okay? I've been recommending this for a long time. Tape dispenser. This is a desk mount tape dispenser, okay? This comes from Amazon with a little clamp. You clamp it to your desk, or you can screw it down to your desk, however it's convenient. I actually tape it to my desk. It's very meta, okay? So this is a two-inch tape dispenser. Um, prepping something just one hand all the tape I need okay did okay just like that real nice works perfectly um, you know not the best tape dispenser in the world but it's desk mounted so it works real nice um, another thing that I really like um, these Germex antibacterial wipes okay use them all the time to take residue off there's stuff that like residue wise um, alcohol and paper towels can't quite muster these Germex wipes absolutely actually cut stuff right off. They're not hard on your hands. It's actually a pretty good product for taking stickers off stuff. Now, here's something I wanted to show you guys. I have this. This is my little caddy that I use. This is my office caddy. So I have like scissors and pens and pencils, but I made this with a coffee can and a uh, uh, peanut butter jar, okay? So you can put, you know, your Scotty peelers in here, your chemicals in here, have them right in your hands you know, right where you're going to go. This is really, really a time saver. And the last thing I want to leave with you guys is paper towels. Now, you guys probably all use paper towels. We all do. But really buy the best paper towels you can get. The best paper towels you can get are not paper towels. This is linen, okay? These are linen towels, okay? Linen towels on a roll. Um, these come in a 36-inch diameter roll. The roll is about $100 foot wide by 36 inches in diameter. Rolls very expensive, but it's worth every penny of it because one of those rolls lasts me over a year. Okay, I got this last year sometime. I'm probably gonna pick another one up pretty soon. Uh, pretty soon. The company that makes this is called New Pick. Um, I don't know if you can get these outside of Pennsylvania. These are made for the oil field industry. So they're super heavy duty, okay? They're, they're real thick, real abrasive. They really get stuff off. If you can't get something like this, okay, go and get shop towels, like Scott shop towels. You can get them at uh, Home Depot, Lowe's, Walmart, okay? They're like two bucks a roll, okay? So they're a little bit more expensive than your standard roll, 
but you'll feel the difference, okay? Definitely worth the couple bucks, okay? So, another thing, I don't know, this probably isn't really a secret, but poly wrap, okay? If you're gonna be putting like uh, stuff that's, uh, you know, you want a poly bag to keep it nice and pristine, some toys, stuff like that, but you don't wanna waste the money on poly bags, poly wrap. Pretty fast once you get used to it. It's a little slow and awkward at first, but once you really get good with it, this is an incredibly fast way to wrap stuff. Um, it looks good, uh, easy to do, um, takes some getting used to, but this is definitely good. Um, you can buy, I think, a dozen rolls with the handle for like 30 bucks off Amazon, okay? Um, I love it, so again, let me just sh real quick here show you guys, tell you guys what to look for. You want linen towels, not paper towels, linen towels, shop towels, okay? Germex wipes, plastic razor blades, there's what they look like on Amazon. Alcohol dispensers, and that's about it, okay? So, oh, and um, desk mounted tape dispenser, and mousetrap tape dispenser, okay? Those little things have helped me get so much faster with my prep than I ever was before. So. Um, you know, if you're unhappy with how long it takes to do prep, those are the little tricks that I use to get that prep time down. Okay? I hope this was helpful to somebody. Talk to you guys later.